We can't talk here. Too public. Meet me behind the great chapel at midnight. Don't let anyone follow you. I'll make it worth your while. Yes? Ah, you came. You're sure you weren't followed? Good. I thought I could trust you. Nobody else in town. They're all in on it. All watching me. Well, yes. I need you to do something for me. I'll pay you gold. You like gold, don't you? Lots of gold. Here's my problem. I'm being followed. Watched. Marukati selectives, maybe. Not sure. I'm a threat, you see, to their plans. I know too much. I need you to check out some people for me. The ones who are following me. Watch them. See where they go. Who they report to. Will you help me? Very good. You won't be sorry. I'll pay you well. Did I say that already? Let's start with Bernadette Penniless. Be outside my house at 6 a.m. You'll see her watching me. See where she goes and who she reports to. We'll meet here again tomorrow night. Oh, and never contact me in public. They're watching. They can't know you're helping me. Her house is almost directly across the street from mine, southwest of the Great Chapel. Coincidence? I don't think so. There's so much I could tell you. So many secrets. But then you'd be in danger too. It's best if we're not seen talking. Remember, Bernadette Penniless, 6 a.m. Don't let her see you watching. Hi there. Well met. Well met. I don't mean to gossip, but he is more than a bit strange. However, He's always been tolerated as the town eccentric. I learned quite a bit about how to use a shield from Ambrose Can. Cost me a bit, but it was worth it. Goodbye.
I'm Bernadette Pinellis. I work for Tamika. I grow grapes for her wines. I've lived here all my life, grown grapes. It's all I know. Fresh air, mountains, the grapes on the vine. It's just beautiful. Hammer and Tongs is a good place to get your armor repaired. Just don't go early in the morning. Agnet usually isn't feeling so well then. Well, I know he's a bit odd, but I've always thought he was kind of sweet. Lately, though, he has been stranger than usual. I think maybe he's been following me. I see him every morning on my way to chapel. I've tried to say hello, but he always pretends not to hear me. Certainly. Thank you. How kind. Good day. Excuse me, but you have to leave now. I, if you don't mind, I have things to do. Would you I leave did. now, please? A pleasure to speak with you. Goodbye. Have you been well recently? Greetings, champion. Good day. saw Bernadette Penelis, did you? She was watching me and following me, wasn't she? Just as I thought, just as I thought. Excellent work. There will be a bonus in this for you. Don't worry. Ah, of course. The gold. Here. But there is someone else I need you to investigate. Tutius Sextius. Do you know him? A quiet fellow. Appears harmless enough. But I've identified him as one of my key suspects. He's a clever one, no doubt about it. Eyes in the back of his head. Always seems to know when I'm watching. But that's where you come in. You should wait outside his house and see what he does when he's not watching me. I'll meet you here tomorrow night to get your report. I always suspected she was watching me. Thank you for finally confirming it. He lives in the large house between the low gate and the east bridge, alone. Suspicious, don't you think? Don't let Tutius Sextius catch you falling. He's much more dangerous than he looks. Hello. Excuse me, but you have to leave now. I need to lock up. A little bird told me that you've been asking around town about Glarther, a resident eccentric. I'd like to know why. Let me give you some advice. Glarther is crazy. So far, harmless crazy. But I keep an eye on him because it's my job to. 
You don't want to get involved with him. I don't care how much he's paying you, it isn't worth it. Like I said, he's crazy. Since you're courteous enough to tell the truth, I'll do the same by trusting you to talk to a guard. He asks you to do anything strange. I hope I can help. Not only does Shamir make a good wine at the Tamika Vineyards, but he's really good with his bow, too. I heard he'll train you for a fee. Farewell. Sorry, I have things to do. You'll have to leave now. Sorry, I have things to do. You'll have to leave now. You're new here, or you'd know me. Tutius Sextius, my people have lived in Skingrad since the dawn. Father and the Count were best of friends. I'm sorry, but I don't think I know any Glarther. Oh, wait, do you mean that strange wood elf that you see wandering around the city? Yes, I've seen him, but never spoken to him. He seems to be at the Low Gate every morning when I pass by on my way to the castle. Gives me the strangest looks now that you mention it. Almost like he hates me, although I have no idea why. Yes, the strange wood elf who haunts the Loke Gate every morning. You said he was Glarther. Well, I'm afraid I know nothing else about the fellow. I've bought a good number of things at Colovian Traders, and Gunder is a friendly sort. Perhaps you should seek out a priest, perhaps a beggar, or guardsman. You and I, we have nothing in common. What could we possibly talk about? Good day. Tell me what you learned about Tutius Sextius. So, I was right all along. You're doing excellent work, my friend. Here you go, my friend. Trust me, you've earned it. There is one last person that needs looking into, though. Do you know David Surly? Yes, of the famous Surly Vineyards. Pillar of the community, etc. Who would ever suspect him? Perfect cover for the ringleader of the whole conspiracy! He watches my house constantly. You'll see. He leaves his house early each morning. Watch him and report back to me here. At midnight, as usual. Make sure he doesn't notice you. The Surly house is right next door to mine. A large house with a backyard conveniently located to observe my every move. Thanks to you, his sinister plans have now been revealed to me. Be careful. 
David Surly is the ringleader. We must not let him catch you watching him. Greetings, High Elf. I need you to leave so I can lock up. If you don't mind, I have things to do. Would you leave now, please? It's time for you to go. I'm David of Surely Brothers Vineyard. Gaston is my brother. From our vineyards come the finest wines in Tamriel. Yeah, well, in all honesty, no. But our wines are very good, and much cheaper than Tamika's very fine product, I assure you. Gaston and I make great wines, reasonably priced. Skingrad has two great vintners, Tamika and Surely. I'll never say a word against Tamika's wine, I learned quite a bit about how to use a shield from Ambrose Can. Cost me a bit, but it was worth it. You may have heard that he's a bit touched in the head, and that may be true. But he's always been a quiet neighbor, never given us any trouble. Certainly. See, for me, thanks. You may have heard that he's a bit... You too. Protect and serve. It's what we do. He's that thief that the Imperial Watch are always going on about. He likes to steal from rich folk. You have something you want to tell me about that nutcase? Really? He's getting worse then. Thanks for letting me know. If you think he's becoming dangerous, you come straight to me, and I'll handle it. Bye. How do you do? Who will help an old beggar? goes it so what did you discover about the upstanding David Surly? 
Well then, I suppose I must believe you. At least now I can be sure. Here, this is your last task. Here's the gold, as promised. I always pay my debts, and then some. Do the last task in that note, and I will pay you much, much more. Something to report? You have something you want to tell me about that nutcase? Why? What's he done? Damn! He's finally gone completely bonkers. Thanks for the tip. Now stand aside and let the guard do their work. I hope I can help. Sad story. But at least we stopped him in time, thanks to you. Not only does Shamir make a good wine at the Tamika Vineyards. Take care. Hi there. You have the Hello. hands of a healer. Oh, how great. You oh, have the hands of a healer. Did you hear that Valcar left you? About the end of the world. I think Deetson is in oh, charge. Oh, no. Without question, I can't believe a Major's Guild associate was found dead in Chico. Hi there. What kind What's of a place on? are they? Oh. Today's your lucky day, so let's hear it. You have the hands of... You want me? You sure? I'm Vigya. I'm Mage's Guild, but I don't train or anything. Adriana's in charge. You'll need to speak to her about it, if you can tear her away from her latest book. Between the two of them, Borisian and Gaspar have mastered nearly every type of spell there is. You'd be wise to go see them if you can. He turned up dead. I guess someone finally got tired of his crazy behavior. Some say that Traven is misusing the power of the Archmage's position to further his personal agendas. Well, it's a bit rugged. Nothing like the Arcane University. Have to go to the Imperial City to buy anything, but it's good enough, I suppose. Bye. Any friend of Martin's is a friend. A cure? 
You mean, besides death? Such a thing is beyond our control. The body is so warped by vampirism, few could be able to revert its effects. Even fewer would care to try. The Guild of Mages might know more. Speak with Ramanus Polus. He may be able to guide you. Good day. How do you do? What's going on with, with you? There are rumors that the Nords are attempting... The Nords have always... I trust you have a good reason for interrupting me. It's been the home of the Mages Guild for the longest time. You should see the library they have there. It's the only place worth visiting in the Imperial City, if you ask me. I only make the trip if I can't find a specific book here. There's at least one person in every guild hall who offers spells. Check at every hall to make sure you don't miss any. I'm afraid I haven't given it much thought. I'm rather busy, you understand. My research occupies nearly all of my time. Now that I think about it, I do have a small problem concerning Earthor. He's one of the guild mages here. Think you can do something about it? Excellent. I just don't have the time to search for him again, but I do need to consult him about some notes he borrowed. You might want to ask around and see if anyone can be of some help. Let me know when he's back, and you'll have your recommendation. He's... well, he's an interesting fellow. Salinus Vecinus can tell you more about him if you wish to know. Salinus should be around here somewhere. Talk to him if you'd like to know more about Earthor. Any luck finding Earthor yet? I'll need to speak with him before I can feel your recommendation has been earned. What? You want a tour? Can't you see I have a lot on my mind? Go bother a beggar or guard. They stand around and chatter all day. Have Earthor see me when he gets back, Associate. Be seeing you. Well met. Is it me? Or is it quieter around here with Earthor missing? Absolutely. Good news from Kavach for a change. The last of the Daedra have been driven out. Fine. See you. Take care. Too long since I've seen a good brawl. I hear you got quite a task for Madriana. The guild can provide you with some training, but the best trainers are usually very hard to find. The Mages Guild runs more or less like it always did, but we lost quite a few members when the practice of necromancy was banned. Have you met Adriana Berena, our Skingrad Mages Guild head? Not the most pleasant person, I'll admit. <laughs> Don't mind her. Interested in training? I do the conjuration courses and Druja does the mysticism. A nice enough guy, I suppose, but there was that awful scamp incident last year. That's when Adriana told him he needed to practice somewhere else. Somewhere else? Meaning somewhere far away. So he settled down in Bleak Flats Cave, did all his work there, and came back to town twice a week to check in. Hasn't been around lately, though. Oh, dear. I just can't seem to remember where that is. What a shame. I'm here to help if you need me. I hope I can... I'm here to help if you need me.
Hello there. Well Hail. met. I plan to visit the Imperial City soon to pay my respects at the Temple of the One. They say the dragon statue is 100 feet high. Interesting. How are Goodbye. you? Greetings, Orc. What is it? What's new with you? Anvil is all in Rumor an has it. The nerve. Just... Hello. Good to Greetings see you. to you. Oh, and hi there. Hello. Hello. Is it me? First or is it quiet around here now with Earth or missing about the end of the world? No doubt. What's no. the news from the other parts of Tamio? Absolutely. The new Hello. You know, I saw your f Take your time. It for me? Oh dear. I just a nice enough somewhere else. So we. I'm here to help if you need. It's you. Hi. What do you want? He hasn't shown up here in a while. I assumed he was still out at Bleak Flats Cave, where he usually stays. I don't remember where it is, honestly. I know it's west of Skingrad. Druja could probably tell you. She has a better memory than I do. Good day. You're in good company, like friend. You. Welcome. Well most Hello. people consider Martin's transformation a religious or How political event. But what interests me? I see. Did you hear that Val... What do you want? Adriana may read too much, but you should see the summon spell she taught Viga. He might teach you if you're skilled enough. It's just northwest of Skingrad. Here, see it on the map? That's where Erthor wound up after Adrian told him he couldn't practice in the Guild Hall anymore. She probably doesn't even remember that. You might want to make sure she remembers, especially the part about it being her idea. I haven't seen him in quite some time, but then this isn't the first time he's been away. So I wasn't really that concerned. It's a town like any other. Well, go outside and there's the mountains and wines and sheep. Here in town, though, nothing special. The Mages Guild runs... Good luck is finding it me, Berthold. or is it quiet Not around here with Erthor? Is it me, or is it Without quieter question. around here with... You're here about that recommendation, I presume. I'll need to speak with Erthor before I write it. Oh, I do remember telling him to go there. Mm. Well, we'll just have to do something about that, won't we? By we, I mean you, of course. I have something that may help. It's a basic fireball spell, in case you need to defend yourself. I'll be here when you get back. Good luck. Want something from me?
You, how did you get in here? Are those horrible creatures gone? I'm not going anywhere until they're gone. Horrible things. Are the creatures gone? I want to get out of here. I've been trapped for days. I don't dare move a muscle until they're all dispatched. Well met, guildmate. They're all gone? I can leave the cave? Oh, thank you. I'm ever so grateful. You're heading back to Skindrad, aren't you? Could I maybe come with you? It'd be safer, I think. So, what do you say? Oh, thank you. You're just too kind. I'll be right behind you. The services provided at the Arcane University are just priceless. You can create your own enchantments there. Things in the guild have been different since Traven was named Archmage. They're more structured, but everyone seems tense. I can't wait to be back in Skingrad, safe and sound.
Hi there. How goes it? Greetings to you. You're here about that recommendation, I presume. I'll need to speak with Earthor before I write it. Have Earthor see me when he gets back, Associate. encounter welcome I'm sure the Elder Council will find some way to hold the Empire good to know anvil is all in it what can I do for you I've spoken with Earthor, who seems to be all right good work I'll see to it that your recommendation is sent in as soon as I have a free moment. As I've said, I'm rather busy. I'll get to it eventually, though, I assure you. Take care. May the wind be on your back. Oh. My pleasure, Hello. really. I can't well, what's going on with you. Good morning. So found dead what's and going on? What's, going what's going on? What kind of a place are they on the expedition? The What's new with you? I ran mm, across a couple of mud crabs. Huh. Ugly things with their yes. thick shells and sharp claws. Goodbye. You too. Still warm. Looks like there's a killer about it. May you rest. Morning. Him. What's new with you? How goes it?
What do you think? Does that new arena combatant even stand a chance? Well met. Absolutely not. I can't believe it. The Grey Prince has been beaten. There's a new arena. Hello, Associate. To earn a recommendation from me, you need simply prove you are able-bodied and prepared to learn something in the process. Archmage Traven has closed the doors of the university to all who are not qualified to enter. A wise decision, in my opinion. It's in the Imperial City. Perhaps someday you may be able to visit him there. He's done wonderful things for this guild. Unlike some frivolous tasks you may be given at other guild halls, this is a serious matter and has consequences. Are you prepared? Then allow me to explain the task. The Council of Mages has entrusted me with resolving a situation along the Gold Road. Several traveling merchants have been found dead along the Gold Road recently, with even more missing. The Council has asked that I put a stop to it. You are going to help me do so. Indeed, it may well be. I see no reason to shelter you from situations the Guild deals with on a daily basis. This is the important work, the work that matters. I have no time for Guild recruits that are useless in the field. This will be an excellent way for you to prove yourself. As you are new to the Guild, you are less likely to be recognized as a member. This may give you an advantage in getting to the root of the problem. We believe the killings are the actions of a rogue mage. Battle mages have been sent to the Brina Cross Inn, the only common link between the victims. You are to travel north to the Brina Cross Inn and speak with Ariel Gerard. She will give you further instructions. It's a sad thing to think that a mage would kill helpless merchants for the wares they carry. The Anvil Mages Guild is proud to follow the example Hannibal Traven sets for us. Mastery and scholarship free of the dark arts. This is a harsh, dangerous task for you, I realize. Your unfamiliar face makes you most useful, however. And what better way to learn the many uses of restoration? Practical application is often the best educator, even in life and death situations. Some mages do not abide by the principles of the guild and operate outside its boundaries. Many hold little value for the lives of others. The frostburns found on the victims in this case indicate a mage was responsible for their deaths. Likely nothing more than simple robbery. These scrolls should provide sufficient resistance to frost magic when and if you do encounter this rogue mage. Use them wisely. The inn lies north of Anvil. Speak with Ariel Jurard when you arrive. She will give you further instructions. Do not let your guard down. We do not know whether the inn staff is involved somehow. The scrolls I have given you should protect you from the magic the mage seems to use most frequently. But do not let your guard down. He may have more tricks up his sleeve. Not only has necromancy been banned from practice in the Mages' Guild, but the Guild won't deal with anyone who openly uses it.
Let's get to training. I'm willing to teach. I can show you some new. I can show you some new things. You've got a lot to learn. They can't Take care. Be. Yes. Heard any? Let's get this over. Die, Kirby. Afternoon. What's new with you? They say that slavery has been abolished in Morrowind. Hello, stranger. What can I do for you? Karel has sent you, as you know. Go and speak with Kristoff. Rent a room for the night. Once you have your room, I will meet you there. If anyone asks, you are a traveling merchant. Nothing more. Do not say otherwise to anyone. No, friend. I'm afraid I don't know the way to Shaden Hall. But good luck in your travels. Please excuse me. Greetings. How are you? Welcome to the Brina Cross Inn. Can I interest you in something to eat? Or perhaps a bed for the night? Have you seen a land dreg? We call them billies. Don't know why. Steer clear of them, though. Let me guess. Traveling on business? You don't look like you're out for a stroll. Ah, yes, thought so. We get many of them traveling through here. Oh, well, we used to. Haven't seen as many lately. What with the, uh... Well, you know, the murders. I don't like to talk about it much, as it's bad for business. At any rate, would you care for a bed for the night? Right, then. The bed is just upstairs at the back of the inn. Sleep well. Pardon me, did I hear you say that you're a traveling merchant? Don't you worry, what with the recent killings and all? I'd be ever so scared if it were me. I haven't left the inn in days, just in case. Well, you take care of yourself. I'd hate to hear about another senseless death. Good luck to you. Be Good seeing see you. you. What? With all the Hail. farms in Nibane, there's still plenty of forest and wilderness open for settlement. I hey. see. Go ahead, please. Heard any news from the other provinces? I have heard things are bad in Vardenfell. The Telvanni do their best to close the gates, but it is to no avail. It seems it is a dumb. Hello there. All right, it should be safe to speak here. Once you've rested here, you need to continue along the gold road heading east towards Kavach. I shall be following out of sight, along with a fellow battle mage. Make no attempts to speak to us. Trust that we will protect you. Should you be confronted by this cowardly mage, do not hesitate to protect yourself by whatever means possible. 
Once the mage has revealed himself, we will step in and settle a matter quickly. Now get yourself some sleep. You'll need to be well rested. I'm afraid your journey ends here, traveler. I'll be taking whatever you're carrying. After you're dead, of course. I do hope it's more than the last few had. They were most disappointing. to speak to the champion of Cyrodiil. What do you need? Hello there. So, what of the rogue mage? Has he been found? A she, you say? And she's dead. Well, Ariel and Roliand did what needed to be done. No more innocent deaths. At least for now. You have done well enough for yourself. I'll pass along my recommendation to Ramnus. Though I must say, I doubt it will do you much good in the end. You'd be surprised how easily they forget about the little people. Goodbye. Well met. What do you think? Does that new arena combatant even stand a chance? Yes. I can't believe it. The grape... I hear you. Make sure not to eat nightshade. It's very poisonous. Yes? Oh, hello. Stop, criminal! I've heard of you. Your criminal exploits are well known. Here's the procedure. <laughs> 